everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel for those of you who all are new. I am Culture Sims. Today we are going to be doing uh, Let's Play the Generations Part 12, I believe. So in the last part, we had Brennan kidnap Haley, uh, which a lot of you guys were loving. And a lot of you guys are wanting the twins to age up and wanting Haley to age up. I think that is an amazing idea. Also, we really need to bring Brennan's baby over. Um, or at least go and see her because Emma has not seen us in quite some time. So we're going to start off by filling off the bowl. Um, so basically, my explanation for why this video is late... Uh, my hamster actually escaped her cage yesterday and left all of her babies in there. So I have been having to hand feed the babies and take care of them myself since she is nowhere to be found at the moment. So because she decided to play Houdini on us, I have not had the chance to film the video and have it up by the usual scheduled time. So I do apologize. But um, I think what we're going to do today is we're going to bring Haley uh, with us to go and meet her half-sister, Emma. And Primrose is still on the lookout for Brennan and still on the lookout for Haley because she has a feeling that Haley is with Brennan. But she can't find Brennan because every time she goes by the house, he's never there. So what we're going to do is we're just going to bring on over Haley and Brennan and uh, Brennan is just going to come and spend a little bit of time with his daughter and hopefully this little monster over here <laughs> is not mean to our baby Haley because she's not too great with kids guys okay so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna come up here we're gonna cuddle with Emma I really do like her room though I, I know I've been saying for like the last two or three parts that I'm going to decorate this house but I still haven't got there I have not got there, okay? <laughs> Do not judge me. Um, okay, so let's see. I swear that that tire moved. I swear that tire moved. Either that or I'm just going crazy. Okay. So, um, let's see. What can we get into? Is there any, like, thing we can get into as a child? Ooh, can we be rude to her? No? Okay. Like, I was so hoping we could be rude to Mackenzie. <laughs> Um, guess not. Apparently, Brennan is done with baby Emma. So, we're actually going to bring Emma to our place because there's not really anything to do here. And Mackenzie, forget Mackenzie. We don't need Mackenzie. Also, thank you so much to all of the people who are actually watching my videos all the way through. A lot of you guys are pretending to watch my videos. And I guess you don't realize that I have YouTube stats and it tells me the average duration of how many people or how long people watch my videos. And a lot of people are saying, great video, like as soon as I upload the video and then you, you know, it's like a 10 minute video and it's like, you never watch the video. And I'd rather you watch the video all the way through, but if it's not something interesting to you guys, I would like you to leave me suggestions on things you do want to see so that I can make content you want to see. Also, if you guys have actually watched to this point, um, I am doing a special giveaway at 10,000 subscribers. I don't know if I'm going to tell you what it is yet, but I am very excited. So if you guys are not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button because when we get to 10,000 subscribers, this giveaway is going to be awesome. The retail price is $59.99. So it's $60, guys. It's a $60 prize. So definitely hit that subscribe button if you're not already. Um, I will be dropping hints about what it could be or what it is in, like, future videos. So if you guys are actually watching my videos, you will know. So, back to the Let's Play. Okay, so we're going to head on home now. And we're just going to let you go there. We're going to find Brennan. And, oh, can you get up, Brennan? please. Thank you. Okay, so we're gonna follow Haley because she's like, bye dad, I'm going home without you. Um, and Brennan's just gonna follow her very slowly. Uh, let's see. Alrighty, so they are home and oh, I missed my pup pups. Like, a lot of you guys did also suggest that we send Brennan to jail for killing Coco Chanel and for kidnapping Haley. And that Prim and the babies 
move back into this house which i'm totally down for so if you guys are interested in seeing something like that let me know down in the comments and i can totally go that route because i mean as nice as the other house is this one is still my favorite because i did build this house myself um so this house holds very special meaning to me so if that's something you guys want to see prim moving back in or even prim working things out with brennan who knows uh because keep in mind she still doesn't know that brennan killed coco chanel to her knowledge coco chanel is still alive and well um so let me know what you guys want to see down in the comments so we're gonna have Haley come and play with the puppies mm, puppies oh guys look how happy emma is she's so happy to be with her daddy that is so cute. Okay, also we're going to change her diaper and then we're going to let her crawl around. I think I'm going to bring her upstairs actually and let her play on that little play mat. Because the infants can play up here on this thing right here all by themselves. Or you can play with them with their parents. So I think what I'm going to do is have her play around and uh, see if she can start learning like her letters and putting things together with these little building blocks i think that'll be super cute to start teaching her how to do all that and also oh my gosh guys we need to start teaching emma how to walk because we we are just bad parents we have not taught her how to walk or anything yet okay so let's see can we switch on over to baby emma we can and we're just gonna have her play with her toys because she doesn't have any toys at her mom's house. And did you guys see that glitch or was that just me? I feel like I'm going crazy. But then again, I feel like that time that did move. I feel like that time it did move, guys. Um, but either way, um, her parents are just neglecting her. And when I say parents, I mean Mackenzie because... I mean, Brennan's kind of been neglecting her, actually, but Mackenzie doesn't have any toys for Emma. She doesn't let her out of her crib. She basically stays in her crib all the time. Um, so she's just getting some very much needed attention here, playing with her building blocks. And Brennan is actually going to come downstairs. And he is going to clean up a little bit. There are no plates for the dishwasher to clean. Really? what are those <laughs> what do you call these i call that plates to clean okay what can we do with this we can think about beans and compare coffee beans mm, nah. um hmm can we do anything with this no i feel like i keep feeding these dogs and then they just immediately go over there and eat it and then i'm like oh, shoot me guys so brennan is home with Haley and emma and look who decided to stop by because she's seen the car outside that is right primrose primrose is in the house everybody and uh, she knows brennan is home now so she's just gonna come and knock on the door prim that is not the door just walk right in i guess because it is your house <laughs> um all righty so let's see they're gonna be rude because Prim's like, look, I know you have my daughter. Where's my daughter? You've had her for a whole week and you keep dodging my calls. You keep dodging me every time I come by. I'm not doing this anymore. You know, she wants her daughter and she knows that Brennan has her because it's his daughter too, you know. I mean, obviously he'd be the first suspect to take the daughter. So, you know, she's just like, look, if you don't give me my daughter, I'm gonna call 911. <laughs> and then you're gonna go to jail which coincidentally he's still hiding from killing coco chanel so that's not gonna work out too well for him so prim's actually gonna come on in here because brennan told her where Haley was and of course Haley is just fine because i mean he would never hurt Haley. um and she sees that Haley is just you know playing having a good time playing with lilac and you know she feels bad i mean she does but at the same time you kidnapped her daughter oh my gosh guys okay so this is austin which a lot of you guys might remember austin because he dated prim while her and brennan were on a break um before she got married to brennan well he's a police officer um if you guys can see here um he is a police officer he's a rookie cop but a police officer nonetheless and his sergeant just told him that a lady called from North Berry Street and her wife is missing. Any guesses who that could be? I'll give you four seconds. 
yeah coco chanel she's missing um okay so they don't know she's dead but they know that she's missing and they know that brennan was the last one to see her alive so austin is going to go over to prim's house or prim and brennan's former house and uh he's gonna talk to brennan and see if he can get any information out of him and see if he can tell him anything that they don't know basically so let's see they're gonna come on over here huh <laughs> romantic flirt mm -hmm. <laughs> um no so they're gonna <laughs> come on over here and they're gonna talk and he is going to ask him a couple of questions like where did you go after you know you left coco chanel's place when was the last time you seen coco chanel when was the last time you heard from her you know the basic stuff and he's basically going to see if brennan slips up and says something he's not supposed to or if maybe he slips and gives them a little bit of information that they don't already know you know he's trying to get clever and get sneaky with his questions and um basically see if he'll slip up and say something and catch him maybe in the act maybe he did it maybe he didn't maybe he knows who did did prim do it you know that kind of thing she's also going to talk to prim i mean not as an officer because that would be like conflict of interest because they dated so they have a history um the only reason he gets to do it to brennan is because brennan's a jerk and uh his captain's like look we're shorthanded we need all the manpower we can don't talk to the wife just talk to him see what you can find out um so that is what he is doing and prim is just kind of sitting here listening like I knew there was something wrong. I knew something was going on. I knew, I knew it, I knew it. But I didn't know that Coco Chanel was missing. <laughs> She's Because Prime is, like, kind of mad that she didn't get her, like, hit on Coco Chanel because Coco Chanel did her dirty like she really did Coco Chanel and Prim were good friends growing up in school and of course being in different cliques it obviously it split them up but you know they used to be cool and then what she did with Brennan was just totally not cool so uh Brennan is just you know kind of chilling out and now Austin is just kind of sending a text you know giving his boss some info um let's see i don't know what that's about but hello um so basically austin is just sending some info to his boss and was telling him some things that he heard before he heads back to the precinct let's see can we send him to work and actually have him talk to his boss we're gonna accompany our sim to work let's see okay so austin's basically just heading into work and he is just going to continue to do his job until his boss gets there. And then he's just going to talk to his boss and let him know what he found out. Alrighty, guys. So he actually just completed his shift and he did talk to his boss. So now he is just going to head on home and see if he can do some research on Brennan and see if he can find any, like, security footage or anything like that. Um... Or you know what? Let's just do that here. Can we do that here? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know if we can do that here. Why is there a dog kennel? Oh, can we have a police dog? We can. Oh, that is so cute. I really need to finish unlocking this stuff because your girl is kind of slack and I haven't bothered to. Can we eat these donuts? Fire monkeys. We need to be able to eat these donuts. Please, 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 please make these donuts edible because, oh my god, that'd be so cool. Um, okay, so we're not going to have any coffee or anything. I was hoping that we could kind of do our research here, but unfortunately it doesn't look like we can. And all of this stuff is still locked because, like I said, I'm just slack. Um, so maybe I will unlock all of that stuff. And maybe we can go through the process together. I don't know. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you guys have any suggestions for what you would like to see in the next episode, um, definitely let me know down in the comments. Also, leave me things that we should do with Austin to Brennan. Like, 
Should he bring him in and interrogate him? You know, that kind of thing. Let me know down in the comments because I really think that this could get interesting if we all interact and share ideas. Give me some ideas down in the comments and I will totally implement them in my series like I have been doing. So like I said, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure and give it a big fat thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button because once we hit 10,000 subscribers, we will be doing that giveaway. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next episode because I have a feeling it's going to be a good one. Bye, guys.